Hey everybody, welcome back to Jade Falcon Freeborn. So the crew just got back from watching the attack of the Polymore Coder Man. So we're ready to do to uh, do some rumbling here tonight. Um, let's have a look at the contracts. We've got the Flashpoint available. Uh, we've also got Weakest Link. Depends on how quickly we do this contract. Um, we've got enough pilots and I think we've got plenty of mechs to do this. Uh, it's only a like two and a half skull flashpoint though, but I think you know if we just take three guy three three people at a time, um, we should be able to you know at least kind of balance this out two and a half skulls. So clan loot catch. Let's see what we can get out of this or cache, whatever you want to call it, against the pirates. So it shouldn't be that bad. All right, what do we got here? Relics, eh. Seems like his players are, eh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go full salvage. See what we can get out of this. And let's deploy, um, I have no idea what to expect. I did not read anything, so let's go this route. Actually, you know what? Let's bring, um, let's bring Giant and Eagle in. And let's go with the Mad Dog crew. Let's run this, guys. I think this is probably the best way to go. And deploy. Alright, let's see what we got to do here. Apparently our employer is trapped in here. So we got to go get them out. Looks like a turrets. We got turrets. We got mechs. Yeah. Let's go wreck face. Kind of what we do best. Wow. You can see these guys already, eh? Sure. The question is, though, can they see us? We'll found, eh? Sure can. Raptor 2. All right, fire in the turret. Come on, guys, let's go. Oh, commando. Yep, thanks for showing up, buddy. Judgment time. Come on, finish it up. Yes, thank you. I had no idea what's in there, but uh, don't want arrow, don't want snipers, don't want any thumpers, don't want any of that crap. See ya. Ghost. Okay. They are sorely outmatched here. You did. Okay. Expulses or VSPLs or something? Medium heavy laser pirate. Huh. Okay, who's going first? Most likely the Raptor. Either that or the ghost. Oh, commando. Okay. Running won't save you. Alright. 
Thank you for showing up. You just don't got the right stuff. Let's... What, is that a minefield over there? It sure is. Someone's dropping some minefields. Clippy turret. Uh... Remove the command if we can. Thank you. One less target. Oh, plus three hundred and fifty heat. Meltdown. Ah, nothing was as satisfying as that one meltdown in that battle we had. Freaking melted down. Can you... are you in a minefield? You are. Roger. Full speed. Yeah, let's fire on the raptor. Uh, I'm gonna cool off a bit at the same time. Get a bit better chance to hit. Hey. Not much I can do. She's standing right in the minefield. Mm, this is farther normal okay. for now. Huh. Sure. Uh, no, we're good this way. Okay. Big fat minefield right here. Whatever you're using, buddy, you gotta get rid of it. Yeah, more minefields. It's that Calliope turret, probably. Let's just go with the HEs. Okay, he's lost evasive. Don't know how fast this guy is. I hope he doesn't go before me. But I bet you he's gonna... No? Oh, well, maybe... Okay, that guy walked right beside me, so I didn't take any leg damage. Receiving you. So yeah, they didn't use uh minefields. On the move. Turned your back on me, buddy. Sure as hell is. Okay, let's get inside this guy and HE it up. And Warlord, give us a bit better chance to hit, cool off a little bit, and fire. Okay, is that guy gone? Okay, 
Okay, one damage from the minefield. Jesus Christ, we gotta fix the path. Oh, I, I guess I can't get up that other way. Cool off and fire. Nice. Sure was. Okay, we gotta get and get those turrets now. I'm interested to know who was firing the thunder rounds. Shut the hell up. Calliope turret, hardened LRM, hardened sniper. My turn. Gotta start on it. Yeah, Commander. Let's move. He's probably the guy that's raining down the, uh, the thunder. Or it could be the LRM, I don't know. Um, On the move, full speed. A, B, and fire. See ya. Get some evasion up. Keep hammering this turret, please. And fire. Okay, so he should be gone early next turn. Maybe they can't see us now. Hardened LRM. Okay, let's multi this up. Aye, aye. Ooh, not quite enough. We should get enough from, uh... Position confirmed. Huh. Maybe we got enough this way. So that can go to A, these can go to B. Let's see if that's enough. Yep. That was lucky. And Gaucho should, in theory, be able to finish off that other turret. Uh, let's not go with the swarm, though. Just go with LK. And fire. Trashed it. It's always worth a lot, girl. It's always worth a lot. Give him some between the eyes, please. Roger that. Waiting for orders. Location confirmed. Racking up those easy eights. Taking the shot. There we go. One less turret. Orders. Not leaving anything for the commander, eh? You selfish bastards. Of course you do. Um. Heading out. Oh. Really, really low chances to hit. 
Just pot shot him with the lasers. They might be at a range where they can't see us. Standing by. And you got a fair chunk of ATMs, so let's use them. Save some of these just until we have a better chance to hit. Yes, Who the hell brings a locust to a heavy mech fight? Bushwhacker Commando, okay. Sure. Wow, a whole three points damage. Good thing we'd have to pay for ammo. Okay, people, we need to get in this bushwhacker. A fire starter could be could be a problem too, but so keep your eyes open. But I want everybody on that whacker until he's gone. Alright, firing. Fire. Ooh, head hit, nice. Receiving you. Oh, Who's up front? You are. Can we get oh man, we can't even get a line of sight yet. As fast as I can. No worries. No worries. See ya. Ready for orders. Yeah, they're all down in a valley there. There's nothing I can do. Except for rain ATMs down on them. Good to go. Moving out. Saving the warlord till it's more effective. How much HE do we have? Nice. Now he's got to walk. Well, let's hope he walks. Locust is coming in for a melee attack because that's, you know, that's what locusts do. Primary ability, kick the uh, assault mech in the shins. <laughs> really? Okay. Making my job easier. See what this bushwhacker does. He's going to walk over and shoot, I think. Thank you, Julie. You know the job, people. Uh, hey. Hey. You know what we need. Wow. Enemy mech. <laughs> he just <laughs> nice laugh too. <laughs> destroyed. Just laugh it up at him. Coffee. It's like he shows up to yeah, die. Oh, God. These guys are hilarious. Whatever. Hello. 
Wow. You better not miss this friggin' locust with those missiles or else you're gonna hit the awesome. Might as well Warlord it too, just to teach this guy a lesson. Alright, let's capture this base. Can you actually get up there? Of course you can't. It's all yours, girl. Okay. Ready for orders. Racing for impact. Ah, uh, Commander. There it is, folks. Glad to be of assistance. Try not to get kidnapped in the meantime. All right, two hundred sixty-one thousand. Not bad. Uh, next. Doesn't look like we're th that badly damaged. I don't think I'm going to um, repair these guys because I don't think we'll run them again. Commando parts. We could get a piece of a commando here. Uh, anything else interesting that is going to go with this group of guys? Probably not. Fire control system machine gun. I really hope I get this in the next series because I want to build a machine gun boat. Um, what else here? Patchworks. Let's grab these. Uh, sensors tracker, sure. Uh, LK Thunder half loads. Augmented Thunder half load. Um... Yeah, I don't know. Like I said, we're at a point it doesn't really matter what we take. Let's just... Uh, I want the incendiary half-loads. I think I want the thunder half-load. We're going to go that way. I don't want the thunder incendiary. Really, the only way that that, that is going to work is if you have like an LRM-80 and you lay this down. And then when somebody moves, they take a bit of damage and then like a ton of heat. Yeah, let's just go this route. Okay, bushwhacker parts. Oh, only two commando parts. We might actually finish up a whole commando, though. Yeah, eh, eh. Bunch of junk. Relics number two. We dug up a hole. Yeah, we dug you out of a hole. There's a huge complex SLDF era equipment buried beneath us. Most of it's damaged, though. Appears to be ancient Rimworld's cache, or maybe just a storage dump. It's all ancient history now. Uh, pretty interested in what we found. They refused to back down, saying they weren't afraid of ghosts. We took some heavy losses getting the IE folks to safety. As representative IE, we wish to procure your services. Um, we have a dig site with some artifacts we need loaded up, cataloged, indexed, and packed for interstellar travel. We'd like you to guard the base for us, or... We need assistance recovering our captured test pilot. Extremely odd artifact that requires skills to operate. Fortunately, we have no one else. Right blending of piloting and aerospace skills needed to operate. Needless to say, recovering our specialist should be your highest priority. Um, let's defend the base. Let's go do that. Okay. Send us some recovery vehicles to see if they can get their man back. Yeah. Yeah, we would. He would feel be upset if we just let this get stolen. We're not going to repair. And we're going to go with the same lance, I think. Good salvage on this one. They've all taken a little bit of damage. Wow, pilots are really low on skills here. It is two and a half skulls, though. Um, I 
Yeah, let's just do it. Okay, here we go. Pirates are almost upon us, eh? Flee, huh? Ready for orders. Well, let's get a solid red line if we can. Sure. He's not going to last very long. Club, no. All right, fire. I wonder if his job is just to absorb ammo. Just absorb a few hits. Sure is. I think he's in a lot of pain too. Oh, what's that? Oh, catapult. Okay. Nico Kage? Neko Kage? Sure. Yep. I think I hit something good. Run on that pirate garbage, are ya? Receiving you. Understood. Moving fast. Urban Mac, what's he got? Rocket launchers. Shred him. It's not really that tough, but that's a lot of rocket launchers and it's a good hard punch, so... Better off punching him in the face first. See if you can finish this guy up for me. Getting a bit of lag tonight, and I have no idea why. I think it's, you know, this uh, attic. Like I said, we were I was putting installing the uh, AC today. I think it's just that it's just hotter than normal up here. The computer's a little bit slower than normal. But it's also been on all day too, so that's the other thing. Managed to. I didn't get as much done as I wanted to get done today. It's just way too hot up here. The attic's basically the length of the house, maybe about half the width of the house. It's, it's a good size area. Um, and I've only got a portable AC up here. So it's been taking quite a while to uh, cool the attic off. Ah, uh, just hammer him. So I had the portable AC on. Had the fans circulate in the air, it didn't matter, so I wasn't able to do a whole bunch up here today just because of how hot it was. But once this thing gets the, the uh, humidity down up here, it'll be a lot easier. Like, I'm actually comfortable up here with the uh, AC off right now. It's been running all day. Um, let's just go with the torso. I know they're going to have reinforcements okay, in a second. I hope well See ya. Here we go. Enemy destroyed. I've got eyes on hostile reinforcements. They're heading your way. Of course they are. The 
They're probably coming from both sides. So, how far can you move this way? See anything there? Oh, we got something up here. Ghost. Okay. Good to go. Um. What else do we got up here? We got assassin, a trooper, Kintaro, and a ghost, eh? Bet she's not a super trooper. Wow, it's really bad chances to hit. Waiting for orders. Uh, you're the triple ATM. Let's get you up here. Let's move. Wow, we don't have turrets or anything here. Uh, it's cheating if I've ever seen it. Yeah, well. What? No. That's Throw just me up. complaining. It's just me complaining. At least they got a lot of hit points. What the hell do they have over there? Wow, I'm calling bullshit on this. Yes, Manda. Good to go. Okay, well, at least I get him turned towards me next turn. Wow, we're really slow this turn. Of course it has. By. Move order received. <laughs> See ya. What are you up to? I'm here. Okay. See anybody else? No, just this guy. Targeting for an alpha strike. Watcher, okay. You gotta be able to see the side of both. There we go. On my way, double time. So A A. Like that. Hopefully we can get them both. That's a double kill. Beautiful. I think we can handle this side without a problem. It's the other side I'm worried about now. Hey. Give me some targets here, please, to shoot at. Okay, here we go. We got Irinia, Crab, Crab, and a Watcher. ER mediums are out of range? Really?
Okay, I got a couple hits on this guy. Come on, at least hit this guy once. Ah, damn it. This guy hasn't gone yet. Just oh no, we got shooting too, baby. We got shooting. Warlord, please. Hammer him. Inflicted some heavy damage. Okay, how much back armor does a ghost have? Significant, it looks like. Shit. Okay. Seventy-five, fifty-five, fifty-five. Okay, looks like you pissed him off. Don't worry, we got the awesome coming in here in a second. This guy's shooting for buildings, though. Okay. Sure. Okay, got the tag on him. That's good, anyway. That's good. Yeah, I wasn't expecting to hit there. Okay, make him think twice over there. Yeah, Commander. Moving to position. Well, enjoy it, buddy. Might be able to get a, well, I don't know. The ghost will probably go before us. I was going to say, we might be able to get a double kill next turn. Which would free up one of our mechs, but that's going to be unlikely, I think. Okay, got their eyes on us now. Ghost is probably going next. No, Arinia. How hard do we want to push these guys? Pretty freaking hard, I think. Uh, this guy has not gone yet. Damn it. It's hoping for a better chance to hit than that. Let's just go with the better chance. Let's just go with the better chance to hit. Moving to position. Not bad. Better. This guy's doing the most damage, though. I think. Let's go for the best chance to hit. Can we get them both? Sure as hell can. 
All right, this is a multi you and you. Uh, Yeah. Affirmative. Okay, there's the knockdown. And a kill. That frees up Eagle. Full speed. No target. No, no, we got this guy right here. Negative damage. Yeah. We're getting there, though. Good thing these buildings have a lot of hit points. I remember doing base destruction against this this place, and it's like 900 hit points or something for a building or something. Or 400 or 500 or something. It's crazy. Okay, come on. Plus our pilots are tired too, right? So we're having a harder time to hit. At least our younger pilots are. The older pilots are still pretty good. It's all yours, Judge. Yeah, free back shots. That's going to hurt. No long range missiles remaining. Now you got LK. God damn it. At least they're splitting their fire. Get this guy to go away. Sure as frig is. God, that guy looked just like he was in so much pain when he went down. Okay, who do we have a side shot on here? Crab? Um, yeah, take it with the HE. Nice shooting! Wow! Wow! You missed them all. Really, really. Order? The hell over here. On the move. Full speed. Roger that. Receiving you. Yep, hit him with HE. Damn, I was hoping to kill these last two this turn. <sighs> OK, 
Okay, at least they're targeting me. What? No. Advancing, I guess. Let's make sure we get this guy. Okay. Enemy down. Good to go. Yeah, let's get in on this one. Last chance to get this guy. Aye, aye. No, not for you. Yeah, Commander. On the move. There we go. He's not having a good day, but that's okay. Fire! See ya. I got it. You did. One turn before we had to leave. Mission successful. I was shocked we actually did that well. We lost the building, but, you know, I don't think that was avoidable. We really couldn't do much about that, though. 40% increase in pay, though, so that's kind of really nice. It's going to cover our damages here. Look at the kills, man. These mad dogs. Look at this. Crazy. Those ATMs, man. ATMs for the win. Uh, we could get a catapult and just sell it. Arinia. Sell it. Like, look at all the stuff here. God, yeah. Pirate ERPPCs. Anything amazing down here? Um, actually, let's go right to the bottom, see if there's any prototype double heat sinks or anything. Oh, here we go. Take that. Yeah, we're doing okay with these. Supercharger? Got one still. Chemical small. Does not explode. Chemical small laser. Weird. Weird. Okay, what else? Nothing else down here that I want. So, um, I mean, we could take Patchworks. I got a feeling, though, we should probably take some mech parts. Just finish off a couple mechs so that we can get some sea bills here. Like, that'll work. Could go for three catapult parts as well. We'll get, we'll get more sea bills off a catapult. If we have enough parts to make another one, which we probably do. So let's just go that route. Okay, two assassin parts. One, two, three catapult parts, a crab. Two, three arania parts, flea. One, two ghost parts. Nico Kage, wish I could, wish I knew what that thing was. Four of them, not bad. And then a bunch of other stuff we could sell. So not, not too bad. Okay. Well, we got a commando, hooray. Oh, that's, yeah, that's the, uh, Arania. 84,000 repairs. Let's get this going. Nine days. Reliques de high orbit. EI just, our IE just packed up and left. However, they did leave something of interest behind for us. Studying the thing for a few hours now. Seems some sort of prototype land air mech. Without the pilots, without their pilot, it was basically useless to them, so they dumped it on us. Wish they would stayed around. Uh, let's see what they let's see what they left us at least. So is that it? That's it. Clan loot catch. What do we got? Medium pulse, a grasshopper part. Um, screamer lamb, really. Well, that's interesting. Another Orion part, defense, defensive gyro, fire control system melee. Yeah, you know what though? Let's. Uh, I'm gonna leave that in the lineup. That mech you asked for is for fighting. Thanks. What else is clear for fighting? We got another catapult, or just the Arania? Just the Arania. Let's have a look here. Cool. So now we have a lighter mech to take in with us when we take when we take lower end missions. Uh, 
as much as I want to get this thing going, I'm just going to put it in storage for now. We can bring it out later. Uh, there's a screamer lamb over here. This guy is going to get scrapped. Sniper sensor. Not much else. What are we going to get for it? 339,000. Nah. Whatever junk it's got on that was left over, we'll sell that too. Screamer lamb. Let's check this out here. Okay, LRM5 Telios with dead fire and LK ammo. That's a hell of a lot of ammo for an LRM5. Weapon mounts on the arms. ER PPC, two ER medium lasers. And that's it. Directional jump jets. Fire control system advanced. Engine lamb. Lamb aluminium armor. Lamb structure. This is pretty cool. Prototype double heatsink kit. Uh, does it actually have any prototype double heatsinks? It does not. So let's refit this guy slightly. Let's take out this. Let's take out these two. Let's take out this. What do we have in the way of hard points? Not very many, eh? Three laser, three missile, and one ballistic. How can you have a missile hard point in the center when there's like no place to put it? What the hell were you thinking, guys? And where's the other missile hard point? Where, am I missing something here? It says three mi Oh, one in the head. Ah. Okay. What do we got to work with here? We got 13 tons, which isn't much. Let's take this out, because we can use that elsewhere. Oh, we may leave it. I don't know. Let's just leave it here for now and see what we're going to do here. Um, I don't know how far this guy can jump. What a kind of equipment we have here to help him out. That, well, I guess we don't really need to put anything in here because he's got the directional jump jets and everything. It's just a heat sinking that he's going to have to really worry about. Um, it's a lot of patchwork, eh? I guess you have to have that much patchwork though. Tempted to drop a couple of ER larges in here. We got missile points. Let's max out the armor first. There is a lot of activity on the comms. wonder why that is. Whatever we do, this guy's going to be like... underpowered hmm that's 70 heat though interesting what do we have in the way of not a lot Plasma Lance. Range is 40 meters, though. Which means we got to get in real close if we're going to do that. Taser ammo. Huh. Like, if I was going to build this guy, I'd build him as a hit and run. But not getting in close, staying at a distance, right? You don't want to get in close with this thing. They're going to get shredded. Um, and then maybe... So underpowered. What about an ATM? Got improved. We got an ATM six, which is three and a half tons. One and a half ton. We could put a single ton of ammo on with an ATM three. Or we could put an L I think LRM tens are what two and a half tons are they? Yeah, it's just too heavy still. 
I mean, this is certainly better than an LRM5. And then we've got uh, where are we here? Sorry, ATM ammo. Losing my train of thought here, guys. Um, where's our ATM ammo? Down here. Improved ATM. ER. Inferno. I thought we had... Um, I guess we don't have improved ATM ammo. Got the ATM 9 Pyro, but 7 tons. Yeah, I guess we don't have any other improved ATM ammo. I thought we picked up some, but... ER Inferno... Huh. Well, the LRM5 is one ton. So, I mean... I don't know. Rocket launcher 20. SRM 6 is a ton and a half. I'd almost want to drop an uh, LRM 10 in, but we've got to find a ton someplace at that point. Uh, it's got a comm suite in it. What else could we have? We can drop in this guy here. Uh, let's see here. Slick Suite. This has given us what? Plus three is resolve, plus one initiative. This gives us plus one initiative for the Lance. Increased sensor and sight range for the Lance. I wish I had one of those 100 meter. Um, rangefinders that would be nice Do we leave these guys in we didn't pick up any clan mediums did we I mean we could go pulse lasers what's the range on these guys 460 meters it's still excessively small like if we want to this guy's going to survive in the battles that we're fighting in right now. He's got to stay at a distance. There's really no other way. He's got to stay at a distance. The two larges give us a thousand meter range. We've got to work on heat efficiency though. Two seventy five core. We could make the core smaller. Then we're gonna lose we're gonna lose jump range at that point though, I think, won't we? Uh let's have a quick look here. Uh cores. Go to a two sixty five. Yeah, we can't though. Because we won't be able to run the uh no, we won't have we won't have enough of the jump jets. We've got five jump jets. We've got how do we have five? Does this count as one? Or am I just missing it? There's two, four. Right? Where's the other one? I guess the partial wing system counts as a jump jet? I don't know. I have no idea. Let's go with, yeah, let's go with an LRM-5, and we don't have one, because of course we don't.
This weighs what? Two tons. We don't have anything ballistic wise that we can use, unfortunately. Not within weight, anyway. All right, let me think this. If we don't go with the ER larges, medium ER pulses are 560 meters. We've got one. But if we're going to be jump, here's the thing, if we're going to be jumping and shooting, it's going to be a lot of heat. So, I'm tempted to pull these weapon mounts off and use them for somebody else. What if we don't go this route? Let's say we go this way, and then we just try to sink the heat. It's actually not that bad. Definitely sinkable. Um, how many... I know we picked up one prototype double heat sink. we got lots here. Then we could put an LRM-10 in. We won't have any case, though. What's our primary weapon, guys? Come on, give me some hints here. What's our primary weapon? Large ER pulse. We use one of these. And then maybe we use... The Learn 15s are three and a half tons, right? And we could use swarm ammo, but the problem with that then is we don't have case. Right, these are, if we go this route, LRM 10, ton of ammo in case. All right, that's the damage one, we can repair that. And then we'll have 12 tons of firing uh, what do we want to use here, guys? We want to do damage? Do we want to... What if we put a half a ton... Where are you here? The LRM ammo splits in half for some reason. So the chaff is half a ton, right? Yeah. What if we put half a ton of chaff... And... Do we have a half ton of something... We just picked up some half tons, right? Augmented thunder. It's a full ton, though. There's a half ton. It's not really worth it, though. Not unless you're mass shooting it all, right? Um. Just a regular half load of a regular LRM. We don't have any NARC, do we? LRM incendiary. What do we got in the store? I think we didn't we check the store when we got here. I'm pretty sure we did for ammo and stuff. Um, mag shot. One ton, 330 meters though. We need range on this guy. MML nine. No. Yeah, I don't think Arrow Infernal ammo. We've already got two of these. We don't need another one. LRM safe, LRM double, SRM streak. Okay, so. Hmm. 
Well, if we pull this weapon out, right, because we don't have any weapons in the other arm, it gives us a ton and a half. So if we decide that we want to go with, let's say, where are we here? Deadfire's got a range of what? Minus 40% range. That's really short. Could go with Swarm. Swarm, a half ton of chaff, so if we want to chaff up somebody, we can. We got a half ton left over. I wish we had a. Uh, I wish we had a clan. Um, laser AMS here. What are the range of the micro is two forty, eh? One twenty. Jesus. Two tons for PASRM, eh? Got a regular ton, a regular tag, but we we'll have to take half a ton out then. I mean, our heat efficiency should be pretty good. It's actually not bad. If we take out the prototype double heatsink kit and put in a regular double heatsink kit, where are you here? We can just put an inner sphere one in. Uh, where are, do we have one, or do we sell them? We sold them. It's not helping out much, is it? Man, once we jump, we're screwed. We do that. Prototype double heat sink. What do we got? Forty four fifty three. It's so underwhelming. It's just laughable. It almost is better with just two larges. I don't know, guys. I'm going to leave this as it was. Let me know in the comments section what do you think. What do we want to do with this screamer? Because right now it's just going to overheat like shiz. Right? We'll fire the ERPPC and then we'll be overheated. There's just like... As soon as you jump, right? As soon as you jump, you've had it. I mean, we could go with a ballistic build instead. Like if we put in an, like an Ultra 5 or something. What's the Ultra 5? Um... We have any left? That's the question. We do. It's like ten tons, right? Seven tons. And it's only eight heat. Now we don't get the bonus of the weapon mounts. You know what? Let me just try something here really quick. I just got a brainstorm here. Let's pull all this out. Right? We wanted to change this to the just so I don't forget here, we want to change that to the uh, slick suite, and we wanted to max out the armor. We want to put a 0.25 in the head. Where are you here? Oh, we need a friggin' uh, uh, yeah, we need this more than anything. Let's put it here. No, this side because I got to put the AC in that side. Uh, let's put, where are you here? Um, okay, so we don't have much weight left. Right, not a whole lot. So where's our Ultra 5? Ultra 5. Yeah, once you put that in, in the, in the ammo. Then we can pull a weapon mount. Right? 
Man, I wish the ballistic was in the arm. I really do. Because we need ammo and case. Then we lose all our accuracy. Like you're still better off. Rather than going that way, you're still better off going um, the ER larges. And then a prototype double heatsink. So wait, what's the difference here? The difference is, I got a better idea. So we got 24 heat to get rid of. But if we remove this, right, then we can go with the um, clan heatsink kit, right, which then brings us to 20, and then an exchanger, which brings us to 2. I think that's the way to do it. So we got two ER larges with with weapon mounts, Nova CWS for hiding, exchanger. I think that's the way to go. I mean, the other way to do it would, would have been to put an e-cooling system in here, but I don't think we really need to. We do have it, but we don't have the weight for that. I would rather stay at maximum armor. Let's try this. Let's just confirm this. It's only 90,000 in five days, so why not? And we're going to jump planets after this episode anyway, so we'll head off to a new planet. I'll try and find something like four, four and a half skulls so we can get some lower end missions and maybe take the uh, exterminator, the two mad dogs, and the, um, the new mech, the screamer. I think we do that. So let's allocate some stuff here. So where is the screamer? Let's bring him up to the top. Um, okay, let's. We're going to be jumping, so let's put the Kerberos in the queue. Let's first figure out where we're going. Sorry, I got to figure this out, guys. Let's figure out where we're going first. So, we are right here right now. Two and a half skull planet. We were only there because of um, three skull. We were only there because of the flashpoint. There's a 5, 13 days away, 12 days away. I don't want to go to a lunar environment. Desert's okay. I don't mind the desert so much. That's arid. Comstar and Ghost Bear. We can help Ghost Bear out a little bit. I think that's what we're going to do. We're going to go here. That's 23 days, though. 15 days. Thirteen days. There we go. We'll jump there. So thirteen days. Let's see what we can get back in thirteen days here, guys. Kerberos won't be back. Let's manage our tasks. So we got thirteen days to handle this stuff. So let's bring the screamer up because I want to get that back. So that's five and five. The cat, we don't care about the catapult. Let's do it this way. So Screamer, in five days, these will these three guys will be back. And then in seven days, we'll have these guys back, and the catapult will be down to seven days. And this will almost be done. So perfect. That's not bad. And then we'll be going through our financial report, but no big deal. I think we can sell some stuff at this planet anyway. So I'll sell my junk before we leave. Um... And then we'll head over to that other planet. And next episode, we will take on some Comstar slash Ghost Bear missions. Well, missions against Comstar anyway. But most likely, we'll try and take Ghost Bear missions and see how it goes. But if we have to fight Ghost Bear too, that's fine with me. We'll just have to see how it goes. All right, so I'm going to leave the episode there, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, I did try to make it a little bit challenging with that Flashpoint. But a two and a half skull, it's like we're just kind of a little bit over that right now. So did my best. All right. And until next time, we'll see you all later.